Welcome to John's Meltating Adventures. Here we are searching for history on a new permission. Um, there's so, so many different footpaths on these fields. I've got a lot of work cut out. Let's hope we find something interesting. <laughs> Could have got here and surrounded by lambs. Look at this lot here. Hello. Hello. Yeah, I, I don't have anything though, but I know you're wanting some food, you guys, don't you? I ain't got any. I ain't got any, honestly. Them's two. Remember some pots, some pots today. 19th, 20th century, I should imagine. <laughs> it's a copper love token, it's just slightly straightened, but it is a love token going back to probably 16th to 17th century. 17th century, I would say, love token. My little buckle. Fifty-five. We've got a bit of a, a mug, mug pottery, size of a mug, I think. I'm just having a pot of tea. Nineteen fifties, sixties, I think. Maybe, maybe Victoria. I'm not really sure, but anyway. Bit of pottery. This is a George the uh, George the Second or uh, Sixpence, I think. Sixpence of George George the Second. Excellent. Not in perfect condition, Barry. It'll do me. So I've got my silver coin today. Look at that. Oh yes, it's always exciting finding silver. I love it. I love it. I think it's the 1960s uh, pottery. Look at that. That stripe and design. We have pot, I should imagine. Or a plate, I'm not sure. But <laughs> a bit retro, that, isn't it? It might be 19s, 1930s. Forty-five, an old buckle, seventeenth century. Brilliantly done, very nice. That was forty-five. Yes, buckle going back in time, seventeenth to eighteenth century, I think. Now I've got a bit of a chirping noise on that, but I just thought I'd just dig it with the Manticore. Chirping noise at thirty-five. I dug it, and I was right, iron. Forty five. Oh, oh, it's one of those, uh, oh, it's a 
Yeah. Pewter spoon then, look. Probably Victorian. Yeah, pewter spoon handle. That's what that is. 45. Oh, some is dorky. Found the key to the woman's hat. <laughs> yeah, 47. It's modern key, I'm afraid. Not an olden. Yeah, it's a blue pottery, light blue, I think it's from the 1950s, maybe slightly earlier. Hey, look at that! Found a silver bracelet, wow, this is excellent, superb, look at that, yeah, woohoo! Yes, we'll have a bit of that! <laughs> Awesome, uh, as you can gather, they found something nice. I'm just drinking this finding. It's awesome find. <laughs> well, I think it's great. At least it's silver, but check this out. Absolutely super. <laughs> I'm going to reveal it with you. Look at this. <laughs> silver bracelet. Look at that. Eh? Look at that. Oh man, that is just awesome, or oh, awesome, or oh, what, wow. yeah? That is definitely silver, guys. Look at that pattern on that. Look at it. Eh? Superb. Look at it. I don't know how old it is, though. But look at that. Eh? Superb. It should be all marked inside. Let's get rid of all this. There you go. That's it. We've got it. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Look at that. That is just mint, isn't it? Hey, Gee whiz. Wow. Just beautiful, beautiful, absolutely tremendous. But you just love it. There's any all marks in here, but look at that. All marks will probably be inside. I'll have a little look. I'll clean it up and see if we can find some all marks. I can't see any just yet. But I should imagine they will be there uh, amongst the muck somewhere. Uh, definitely get an age in it. But I think that's quite old. I don't think that's uh, you know um, young. But uh, I think it's uh, around about 18th century. Me personally, that's what I think it is. So yeah, cracking, cracking find. What an awesome find, eh? Is that just to die for? Jewelry. Going back in time. Silver. That's just beautiful, is that? Yes, I'm pretty chuffed with that find. And yet again, I'm starving. I'm ready for some food. Long day, but it's been terrific and worth it. With the bracelet, silver coin, and loads of different artifacts. Very interesting at all. Just a, a tip, just a footpath really, and a bit of one particular field. And this farm has got a lot of fields to do. Uh, so I'll be back for that one. Be back for that one. In the meantime, here we are on this one. So, look at the size of that. I don't even know where it's from. I think some sort of barrel thing. I think I don't even know where it is. So there's that piece of brass there. Sort of um, brass ring from it. Um, some sort of uh, cheap pendant of some kind. Now that's interesting because we've got a uh, 18th century buckle. So that's good. Got a bit of that. And then we've got some um, buttons here. 17th century buttons. Just here, and we've got that dog tag, modern dog tag. But I've got to, I've got to find the owner, which is pretty recent. And then we've got all these different coins, which is all your George III's, uh, Victoria pennies. Um, yes, Victoria. Uh, this one can't really see much, but they're not in really good condition. Won't clean it up really. 
you clean and barrel in all these and then we've got the modern kinds of course we've got the one pences and the two pounds and uh, two pences and the five pences so and then then of course we found six pence probably 1720 or something that period and that are 50 not quite sure got to figure that one out but it's still a silver coin then of course the uh the, the actual awesome bracelet i found awesome i mean this is just immense absolutely immense to find that look at the design on that look at it awesome design really is so that's what i've been that's the final count up we're an exciting day a bit of jewelry silver coin and a lot of different mixture of different artifacts can't wish for anything better been absolutely superb had a great time i will be back on this uh, land i've only been doing one field and he's got hundreds with footpaths so uh, i shall be back on this on this field um, thanks for watching and uh, hope you can subscribe and we'll catch you on the next adventure i have to go awesome piece of kids <laughs> Catch you later.